students welcome to accountancy class i am narsimlu commerce teacher in this video i will explain you cc first year of accountancy in that important chapter subsidiary books subsidiary books and important topic that is opening entry students here i already explained you eight types of subsidiary books they are namely purchase book sales book purchase returns book sales returns book cash book bills payable book bills receivable book and last and final one that is journal proper in the previous video i already explained you what is general proper what are the entries that will be written in the journal proper and the proform of a journal proper all these things i have explained in the previous video so in this video one of the entries that we made in journal proper is opening entry so here i will explain in this video what is opening entry when we are going to enter the opening entry in the books of a business organization and the proform of a opening entry so all these things i will explain in this video students here i already uh, explained uh, in the previous video that so many entries we record in the journal proper there are different types of entries which we enter in the journal proper and these entries which cannot be recorded in other seven subsidiary books means here there are total eight subsidiary books and the entries which we enter or record in the journal proper cannot be recorded in other remaining seven subsidiary books so what are the what are those entries see opening entries closing entries adjustment entries transfer entries rectification entries and assets purchased on credit entries asset assets sale on credit entries and other entries like entries related to consignment business and entries related to stock loss by fire or other accidents or theft so all these entries we can go to enter in the journal proper so here first one that is opening entries so here these opening entries we are going to record in journal proper so when we are going to enter these um, opening entries that is the point what is opening entry and when we write the opening entries in the journal proper all these things i will explain in this a video and one important point is that you may get one two marks question in the annual examination from this topic that is opening entry okay that will be explained in the next video how the question will come in the annual examination from this topic right first uh, let me explain you what is opening entry opening entries are the entries which we made in the uh, books or we can say um, here we open a new set of books in the beginning of the accounting year so at the time we write some entries in the books those entries are called opening entries here very simple opening entries are which are made to open a new set of books in the business in the beginning of financial or accounting year so those entries are called as opening entries and sometimes here some assets and liabilities brought by the trader to start a business then we 
go to write all the entries which we write first in the book are called as opening entries these entries will be written in the journal proper okay students and sometimes what's happening here the assets and liabilities balances in the last year a balance sheet are transferred to the current year accounts so such transfers for the such for such transfers we need to write some entries so those entries are called opening entries those entries can be written in the journal a proper okay so here these are the situation where we can go to enter opening entries in the journal proper and here whatever the balances we taken from the previous year balance sheet can be shown as asset balances can be shown as debit balances and liabilities balances can be shown as credit balances in the opening entry or in the subject journal proper and here the difference between total assets and total liabilities become capital of the organization and that amount difference amount can be transferred to the capital account okay this is the these are the important points that we have to understand in this topic so what is opening entry and how what are the situations when we go to write the opening entries in the journal proper so there are total uh, totally three situations one is whenever we open a new set of books in the business organization in the beginning of the account accounting year then we can go to write these opening entries in the journal proper this is the first situation and second situation is that whenever a trader brought assets and liabilities into the a business then we have to write entries first in the journal proper as opening entries this is the second situation and third third situation is that so the assets and liabilities balances in the previous year balance sheet can be transferred to the next year as a opening balances then whatever the entries we made in the journal proper or called as opening entries and here all the assets can be taken debit side in the opening entry and all the liabilities can be taken shown in the credit uh, balances in the opening entry and the differences between total assets and total liabilities are called net worth of the business or net value of the business and this amount can be transferred to capital account so this is the way and this is the these are the situations where we can go to write opening entries in the journal proper and there is the accounting equation to find the capital okay what is the accounting equation you can go to see here capital is equal total assets minus total liabilities here this is the equation what is the equation to find the capital capital is equal to total uh, assets value minus total liabilities value then we will get capital and if you see the pro forma of a opening entry here it is similar to uh here journal okay so the columns if you observe there are total five columns here in this pro forma date particulars lf number debit amount and credit amount and what we have to write in this entry first you can go to write date then all assets you can tell me the assets what are the assets that we uh, will have in our business generally cash okay cash account debit in the debit column you can go to write amount 
कैश एंड डेटॉर्स अकाउंट डेबिट देन स्टॉक अकाउंट डेबिट एंड कम टू बैंक ओके बैंक अकाउंट डेबिट एंड हियर सन्री डेटर्स वी कंप्लीटेड एंड मिशनरी मिशनरी अकाउंट डेबिट प्लांट ओके अकाउंट डेबिट फर्निचर फर्निचर अकाउंट डेबिट बिल्डिंग्स लैंड एंड बिल्डिंग्स बिल्डिंग्स अकाउंट डेबिट सो ऑल दीज आर द असेट्स लाइक दिस वी कैन गो टू शो द असेट्स डेबिट एज ए डेबिट बैलेंसेस एंड कम टू योर क्रेडिट बैलेंस सो जनरली वी विल हैव ओनली टू टू थ्री क्रेडिट बैलेंसेस क्रेडिटर्स अकाउंट इन द क्रेडिट कॉलम यू कैन गो टू राइट अगेन इज दिस अकाउंट अमाउंट ऑफ इन द क्रेडिट कॉलम एंड कम टू नेक्स्ट वन बैंक ओवर ड्राफ्ट बैंक ओवर ड्राफ्ट वो डी मीन्स ओवर ड्राफ्ट दैट इज द लाइबिलिटी आर बैंक लोन अकाउंट ऑल्सो वी कैन ऑल्सो से इट एज बैंक लोन अकाउंट एंड हियर टू अदर लोन्स अदर लोन्स एंड After writing all the assets and liabilities in the opening entry, from the total assets we can go to deduct total liabilities. Then we will get capital, capital account. Here, this is the amount we will find by using accounting equation. So narration. Here you can go to write the narration. Being a business started with assets and liabilities. being business started with various assets and various liabilities okay sir so like this we can go to write the nars so this is the way how to write the opening entry for the given information this is the perform this is the performa and in this way we can go to write in the uh, journal means here journal proper the journal opening entry uh, i hope student um, or some um, uh, once let me tell you uh, uh, all these things once again here what is opening entry so opening entries or the entries which we write in the journal proper in different situations first situation is that uh, opening entries can be made to open a new set of books in the business organization in the beginning or beginning uh, of accounting period or accounting year that is the first situation and come to second situation is that whenever assets and liabilities brought by the trader to start the business so first we can go to write the entries in the journal proper as opening entries it is the second situation and third situation is that the assets and liabilities balances in the previous year a balance sheet a transfer to the next year as opening balances so at the time we can go to write entries in the book called journal proper as opening entry showing all assets as debit balances and all liabilities as credit balances and the differences between as assets and liabilities value the total assets and total liabilities uh, become the net value of the business it is transfer to capital account okay students so here these are the three situations where we can go to write opening entry in the journal proper i hope students you understood what is opening entry and how the entry will be written in the journal proper thank you for watching this video